Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, back at it again with another review of a pretty hype shoe that a lot of people um, actually been requesting about. Um, released last, actually not last month, just a couple weeks ago. Uh, what I'm going to be re reviewing is the Cactus Trails Travis Scott um, Nike React 270. Uh, let's do like we usually do. Let's go ahead and look at the box. Um, and this is going to be, I'm going to be doing a comparison to the retail pair. Let you know of any differences I see and stuff like that. Drop a comment section below if there's something I might. Drop a comment in the section below in case there's something I missed. Um, so let's go ahead and take a look at the box. All sides real quick. Um, it does say Cactus Trails, size 10. Still has an MSRP attached to it. From everything I know as far as from the box is concerned, the box is correct. Tissue paper is also correct as well. Let's go ahead and take a look. Grab the actual shoe. All right. Shoe like we normally do, quick little 360. So let's get right into it. Let's get look at the right shoe first. Um, a lot of people are looking at uh, the tongue and the pull tab. So let's look at the pull tab real quick. Uh, this is correct as far as um, the retail pair, as far as like this, like a clicking device. And then this is correct as well as far as uh, with the Cactus Shack, uh, with the Nike React actually, the Nike React logo uh, being under that. So that is correct. Uh, tongue is made of like this very soft meshy material that's correct as well same thing with the shoelaces um, let's go ahead and jump same thing with the shoelace loops pattern there as well it's going to be correct so shoelace loops and then pattern there is going to be correct let's go ahead and look at the shoe insert Shoe insert is correct. Cactus Jack. Bottom. And then you're gonna have Nike codes, QR code, and everything's gonna be on there. So that is correct as well. Let's go ahead and look at the right side of the side of the shoe. You're gonna have like this felt material with the Nike swoosh that's gonna be there. And then you're gonna have the classic Nike React 270 sole with, you know, the air bubble, but it has more of like a dirty kind of feel to it. That's what made this uh, Cactus Jack uh, shoe so unique is that it has like a, kind of like a dirty feel to it. This is correct as well, as far as with uh, the front of the shoe and as far as the front of this being uh, like a suede material that is correct as well with the Nike swoosh right there looking on the inside you do have the Nike react logo right there which is correct as well like I said still has that like dirtiest feel looking at the bottom of the shoe that is correct kind of like looks like that worn type of feel to it that is correct as well kind of give you like an idea about it um, and these are the authentic versions I'll give you a look at the back. The back is correct as well, as far as with the Cactus Jack pull tab. That is correct. And the only difference that you would see on the left shoe is that inside of the shoe, it has like a Cactus Jack actual logo, smiley face right there with the Nike swoosh as the mouth. Then you have, again, like very very comfortable um a couple people actually been asking about um sizing on shoes and let you guys kind of know so these ones are going to fit true to size um i put these on and i had a good amount of space my foot's wider so but it was a very very comfortable fit this is a very comfortable shoe uh disclaimer tag on here um Yeah, so uh, this is going to be a very comfortable shoe. I recommend going with your true to size. Um, if you like there to be a little bit of room, but if you want it to be tighter, then I would say go like a half size down. Um, 
give you guys one more good look at these. Again, these are the Cactus Trails. Um, seller's information is going to be in the description box below. Um, once again, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you on my next video.